We did not expect the movement to be blown out in such whereby we collected nearly over 65,000 within 24 hours. It, it has been tremendous. is basically a ragtag team of, of friends on social media um, who decided that um, they wanted to do something to help um, voters who may not be able to afford um, the finances to go home and vote. Total, we have collected close to 200,000, in which we have dispersed uh, around 165,000, and it's still ongoing. Uh, we, as we speak, the team uh, are still doing their their deposits uh, to in, to individual accounts, and we are still compiling a small list just to fulfil the remaining balance that we have. Each of uh, the uh, Participants would have to email us, we require certain documentation. We require them to provide us their details, their contact number and their bank accounts. And with that, uh, based on trust, if they can provide everything, uh, we will just then put them in a list for disbursement. Because of the multiple banks, we couldn't use online uh, facilities. 50 transactions would have costed us about 50 ringgit and that could have sent one more voter home. So we had decided to go the high road and go through the cash deposit machines and physically put in the money to, um, to the voters. There's always negativity about you know, who we trust, uh, how can we trust, but after the first disbursement went in, we could see you know, this amazing wave whereby people are coming back saying thank you, we really appreciate. Uh, people are coming back saying no, I, I can't make it, I'm giving back the money. And this comes from the young generation, you know, uh, mostly IPTA students and there's those coming from the B40 category. Was it worth it? Yes, absolutely. We are happy to have helped about 1,225 uh, voters, most of them first time, um, to go home and, and exercise the democratic right to vote. And we're happy to have been able to be the conduit um, for donors who wanted to do the right thing and help these voters go home to vote. Thank you very much, Malaysians. Uh, let's go back on the 9th of May cast your votes and take a picture of yourself after you voted with your stained um, finger um, and upload it on Twitter or Facebook with the hashtag Undi Rabu. So, selamat mengundi. Perhaps one more thing that I'd like to request. Um, we have another um, movement or another campaign that we're running, which is Budaya Rabu, hashtag Budaya Rabu, where we're encouraging um, people to wear traditional clothes um, when they go out on polling day. So we hope you'll consider that. So just wait.